Actually, the execution really wasn't there that game. It almost looked like a tired crew out there tonight. It wasn't very pretty at some moments. We had our chances again early, but I missed an easy one for three in the first half. I think that kind of sets the tone a little bit more if we make that one. But uh, ultimately, it just came down to execution. After. Yeah, it's a little... It's a little uh, Little, it seems to bite whatever if you kind of get a little soft with your release it seems to go sideways and, and from where we're, from where we come from we have to throw it a little bit soft in order to get some fair all out here and, yeah. and it's just kind of ki it killed us that and it wasn't so bad like that in the other the earlier game we got bad in a hurry at the end of the game but that one was just kind of a little soft the whole time so uh, obviously that's a great a great way to look at it actually and, and, uh, and we play two teams that ultimately give you chances. If you if you were to execute the ball from start to finish, these these are those two teams we played today are going to give you chances, and it's just disappointing, especially after the start when you're one and zero after the start. What's wrong with two and zero? Right? <laughs> as long as you keep going. And uh, but uh, if we had been zero and one, and I would have taken one and one after the day. But now it just kind of feels a little bit. Uh, ice is pretty frosty, and I think if the temperature goes back to cold, which we all hope it does, so we get rid of all the, the frost, it's going to change again. It might be, uh, you know, so you're going to be reading ice now. We actually have to do something and think out there as a team, so it's uh, it's not just automatic. So uh, it makes it a bit of a challenge, especially uh, draw weight. You know, a spot could be really nice, or it could be just a little bit heavier, and you, you know, sometimes like a fool out there if you uh, come up 10 feet short on the draw to the house. So uh, a little tougher to read, and uh, but it, it's okay. I mean, you, you certainly have spots where it's going to curl, Still lots of swing, pretty easy to make some nice taps, there's a lot of good shots made, so we just know that tomorrow if it stays like this it's going to be same and then it might get colder and uh, ice might not be as frosty, so it should be good. Yeah, I mean this one we did have control most of the way once we got the lead and uh, it, it's certainly a nice way to start off the weekend, that's for sure, and uh, you know if the ice stays like this, so it does, and we don't seem to be uh, struggling with it too much. Stop. There's no need to miss that shot, perfect piece of ice and just... Put it back in there. there were a lot of missed opportunities for him. Uh, well, we had him in huge trouble. But what a what a nice roll he makes in the first. And, uh, and I had to try the run back, but that was a long. So the odds of making that are real slim. And then uh, so that was good. And then we got it. Took our one. He forced us. Great hit and roll. Second end. Well, yeah, he's trying to make darn sure. Uh, he didn't know it was to give us a double. So uh, Brad was trying to be real cute with the roll, which he had to be. Um, but there's that straight spot, and that's where I rolled out in the fourth. Same spot, a little bit of a straight spot there, and he found it. And I just didn't pay attention on mine in the fourth. And then, uh, then it was a tough draw he had to throw in five, and that was a big steal point.